big bunker boat and you can see all the life jackets in the boat that's a lot of people in that boat are heading to the islands okay so they're staying at a resort and they've probably heard about the islands but today is special because it is speed boat racing day look at all the people the locals okay on the beach and this young local <laughs> he's running on the beach How are you little pete you having fun he's already been swimming this morning now he loves running on the beach so i'm in sunny pundakit watching the boat race today i got my morning coffee here it's even got my name on it how good is this pj so it's got my name here got my coffee mm. sitting back got the tent behind me and we're going to be watching this boat race here in pundakit just going to walk up coffee in hand and just show you because we've got this one tent out the front here that we've built for ourselves but there are a lot of tents there's a lot of people at the moment there's about a hundred people on the beach with tents and just sitting down on the beach waiting for the race the big race so yeah it is a bit of a, a local festivity you could say is a bit of a festival for us the boat racing and it's lots of fun good to watch here's some boats coming in now some big bunker boats i think they're just bringing in the crowd so I believe the speedboats are the small, more agile ones. Pete found a crab in the sand. <laughs> I can hear all the screams and shrills. Arian's chilling, aren't you babe? This young cowgirl, Filipina cowgirl, she's chilling up out in the hut. What have you got? I think it's a crab. It's baby crab. Yeah, it's a baby crab. Walking down the beach, let's have a look. A lot of people swimming, waiting for the boats to race. And waiting to watch the big race. It's a hot day and a busy day on this Sunday. Actually, this resort just very close by to our home, probably about three or 400 meters. They have three bunker boats. So three big boats full of people headed out to the islands to go swimming at the islands. So Zambales and the Pundakit area, definitely getting more and more popular <laughs> most recently. And it's good to see, good to see tourism back in Zambales.
and here's two boats heading out to the islands right now. They're racing. It's a little bit hard to see from here, but you see that? That's actually the boats racing each other past the point. And here they come. <laughs> go, go, go! We have a sure winner here. Looks like this one is either crashed or the power's out. The engine's out. Did it sink? It looks like it might have sunk. It sunk. Too much power. The boat sunk. So maybe that's why he was lagging behind. He had a problem with the boat and the boat sunk. That's amazing. I feel very bad for the individual who sunk his boat today in the race. That sucks, mate. He, he's having fun. He's playing with his toys on the beach. He loves the beach, little Pete. Don't you, son? Say hi to the camera. Say hello. Don't be camera shy. Come on, bear. Hello. What a view. The ocean is perfect today. Racing has stopped all of a sudden and there's another boat going to search for the guy who sunk his boat. Not a great start. Here's some local vendors trying to sell their wares on the beach. And it's very quiet on this side of the beach. And to be honest, that's where I prefer to be because it's not so busy like down here with all the people. Well, it looks like it's a hot one today. Woo! That heat. It's only like nine in the morning and it's already scorching hot. I walked up a little bit closer to try and get a better view of what's going on. So there's some boats there and it looks like, well and truly, the other boat has just sunk or something. And uh, they're looking for the boat now by the looks of it. So all racing has stopped. And there's quite a few people who have already, you can see, left the beach or are heading back now. So it was all over rather quickly. It might be a while before the races start up again. Hey Pete, say hi to the camera. Hello. <laughs> He's not interested at all. Oh, look at your face. What happened to you? Oh, is that your hands? Hey Pete. Show me the dump truck.
Wilma's here <laughs> and she's cooked some delicacies, some beautiful Filipino food. Some vegetables. Some veggies, all fresh from the local market. Sing. Go, go, go! Sing. Annual boat racing championship here in Pundakit. A bunker boat racing. All right, time to go home. The dogs are at home, in the yard, running around. G'day, Quark. How you doing, pup? Got things to do. Got to water the lawn, do some gardening today. So thanks for watching. This has been Pete from the Property Club. Double thumbs up and bye for now. G'day Bri, how you doing? What, the sun? Yeah, it's hot out there. Come have a beer here, mate. Yeah, I'll do that. So we set up a solar water fountain in our garden overlooking the beachfront. Brian watching from the deck and we're just having a beer having a Sam Mig light and watching the boat races it's good fun actually lots of fun and some of these boats they're pretty quick actually they're pretty fast hmm beer's good let's have another one and there's a lot of boats leaving the venue been a few races but uh, the day is getting on and a few people are leaving, well a few boats actually.